Good morning everyone and welcome to the Trade Talk podcast. On Monday we saw spectacular rally in the market. The market was up nearly 400 points on Nifty and close to 1300 points on the Sensex. It was like the highest gains that we saw in last several years and the gap up opening was like uh, completely uh, remained unfilled throughout the day. In fact, we saw further more gains towards the end and market close at the highest point of the day. The markets are now very close to the next level of 20700 and in the best case scenario we may see the levels of 20850. So that's the view on the Nifty if there is any further more rally in the market, but at higher levels we need to be careful while adding positions on the index. If there is any correction, mild correction, then close to 20500 we should be a buyer in the market because there the market has left a bullish cap so in case if there is any correction then we are of the view that in the short term markets are not going to sustain below the mark of 20500 so easily so there we should be a buyer for the sensex there also we saw spectacular rally and it was nearly 1300 1200 points sort of rally uh, during the day uh, the rally was mainly because of bank stocks all the private banks did extremely well including hdfc bank icici bank and state bank of india so uh, there also we saw huge gains bank nifty in fact managed to surpass its all time high which was far far away from the previous close of 44800 so to cross the level of 46400 uh we were like expecting support from the sbi as well as hdfc bank and other private banks but uh, on monday almost all the banks did well and uh, they closed at the highest point of the day because of that the bank nifty has also managed to surpass the level of uh 46400 which is a big positive for the index and based on that the next level uh to watch out for would be 47000 and 48000 So from current levels if there is any further more rally then 47000 is the next stop but in the best case scenario we may even see the levels of 48000 if there is any correction then 45800 is going to act as major support and there i mean to say between 46000 and 45800 we should look for adding some long positions uh for other indices nifty metal index did well uh it uh, there also uh, almost all the stocks uh, managed to close higher and uh, furthermore gains are likely from stocks like nalco as well as hindalco steel stocks uh, tata steel jsw steel jindu steel and power there also we are seeing some select buying but specifically tata steel and jindu steel and power should be on the watch list apart from that it stocks failed to uh, cheer the momentum and maybe uh, they may start doing well uh, near the announcement of the uh, fed's decision uh, which is uh, due on 13th of this month so close to uh, those particular days uh, we can expect some activity in it companies and if there is any specific uh, indication from the fed chief that they are going to keep the rate uh, pause for the longer time and they may even look for cutting that then Uh, only we can see activity or rally in the it stocks otherwise we are expecting they are also going to remain in the range but yes in the short term if there is any further more improvement in the market then we can expect some mm-hmm. value buying in it companies like infosys so broadly we are of the view that we should be more and more stock specific and at higher levels instead of taking interest in the index it is better to buy if there is any correction in the market That's all from my side with this I'm ending today's call thank you very much for listening me and have a great day to all of you